Jackie Hayden at the bell, and judging will be George Latkin and Vince Delgado, and your referee, Larry Rosadia. Ten rounds. Presenting to you on my left, ladies and gentlemen, a top-ranking featherweight contender, a veteran of 53, as a professional, his first appearance here at the Olympic Auditorium. He weighs in at 127 pounds, fighting out of beautiful Santa Monica, California, Art Hafey. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, his outstanding opponent from Zamboanga del Norte in the Isle of Mindanao. A veteran of 30 as a pro, having lost only one of these, at 128 pounds, the newcomer, and let's welcome him, Rolando Pastor. Rolando Pastor, as you see, is taller than Art Hafey. Everybody is taller than Art Hafey, but Pastor not that much taller. What uh, would we say? I guess maybe two and a half inches. Hafey at 5'2", we know that is his height. Pastor at 5'4". Art Hafey in the white trunks, the green stripes, the number one ranked featherweight in the world by both Ring Magazine and the WBA, ranked number four by the WBC. But two out of the three services rank him the number one contender in the world. Little Art Hafey from Nova Scotia in Canada in white. He loves to bomb. He loves to sock. He has won 45, lost seven with four draws. He stands only 5'2". He weighed 127 pounds today. Contracts 130. They could have weighed as much as that. But Hafey only won 27. He is 23 years old. He has won 16 straight fights has the shamrock on his trunk, so he's an Irish Canadian. <laughs> Listen to Havy's record. He knocked out Ruben Olivares, former Bantamweight and featherweight champion of the world. Knocked out Olivares in 73. And he lost a very disputed 12-round decision to Olivares in 74. Art Havy won his last four fights last year in 74. He won all 12 he has had in 75. Among his victims, he knocked out Famoso Gomez twice. Famoso Gomez, right now, the number two ranked featherweight in the world. He beat Yambito Blanca, a world ranked fighter. He beat Sal Flores, a top 10 ranked fighter at the time. He knocked out Alfredo Marcano in four. Marcano, of course, the former junior lightweight champion. So that's little Art Hafey in the white trunks. He's little, 5'2", 227 pounds, but his neck, Dig this. Look at his shoulders. Look at his neck. He has a 17 and a half inch neck. That's right. 17 and a half inch neck. And you will notice as the fight goes along, well, if it does go along, what looks like a cut under Havy's left eye, it isn't. It is actually a birthmark. A birthmark. Now, in the red trunks, Rolando Pastor, P A S T O R, from Zamboanga, Del Norte, in the Philippine Islands, making his American debut. He is two years younger at 21. He is one pound heavier at 128. He is two and a half inches taller, as we said, at five, four and a half. His record 28 wins, one loss, one technical draw. The only loss on his record to Tyrone Everett, who is the number two junior lightweight in the world. Everett has a record of 40 and 0. So that is the only loss on Rolando Pastor's record. 18 of his 28 wins by KO. Jim Healy ringside at the Olympic Auditorium in Los Angeles, anticipating a war. <laughs> Schedule for 10, that's right. Art Hafey, the Irish Canadian in the white trunks, and Rolando Pastor, nobody down. Schedule for 10. Hafey, a good first round, but couldn't get in the big punch because Pastor Obviously well aware of Hafey's reputation as a knockout puncher of, oh, what a ripping left to the body by Hafey a moment ago. A real belter. In fact, Hafey is known as the toy Rocky Marciano. The Pastor just content to kind of keep the gloves up around the face in round one and not let Hafey, while he's extremely fresh, 
and has all his punch. Clip him on the chin with one. Jim Healy ringside at the 11 go to target. Hafey called the toy Rocky Marciano. He's, he's built like a miniature Rocky Marciano. Alan Malamud, sports editor of the L.A. Herald Examiner. You've seen Art Hafey many times. Is that a good description, the toy Rocky Marciano? Yeah, it's an excellent description. Style-wise, I think it's the closest thing I've ever seen to Marciano. And uh, certainly physically, he's the same way, too. He's got to get inside with those short arms. That's right, the Rock. He had to give away a lot in reach. He was not tall and did not have the long arms. slipped off balance when he caught the left hook to the chin. He caught the left, but not the full force of it. He was not hurt. That's Art Hafey in one. <laughs> Hafey covers up well. Just a little memo for those of you Catch the Olympic fights in Southern California, either in person here at the Olympic or on television. The rest of you, close your ears. Next Thursday night, live here at the Olympic Auditorium, unbeaten Rudy Hernandez, 22-0, against Jimmy Hare, who's been one of the top lightweights the past few years. Red-headed Jimmy Hare. And that fight will be seen on television in Los Angeles next Saturday night. Those of you on our Olympic Auditorium Syndicated Network, please check your local listings for the Olympic fight you'll see. Pastor has, uh, well, he had. And listen to those body whips by Hafey. Start to say Pastor had the uh, left trunk leg caught under his protector. Hafey's got Pastor cringing from the body shots. Oh! A right shot to the body. Pastor, it would have put me down too. Oh, it's all over. A knockout with two seconds left in round number one. And look at Pastor try to get up. He he looks over at me as if this is his corner. He's really out of it. He is staring off. The cornerman, Dr. Schwartz, come to get him. And it was, I'm sure, a body shot that just caved in. Rolando Pastor. So don't ever believe. Ladies and gentlemen, right at the bell at the end of round two, scoring a win by knockout, Art Hafey. So round number one, it was two seconds left in round number two, and we're going to get a look at it again. Now, already Pastor had been stung by the body shots. He was fleeing the body shots. There's a left by Hafey. There's the right hand that I heard, and another left. And here's the big right hand. Well, Pastor was already on his way down from a right to the body, then a left to the body, and Hafey had just started a third right to the body. Luckily for Pastor, he was on his way down then. Right back. Ringside, more boxing at the Olympic Auditorium. It